Dalhousie was established as a retreat for British soldiers and bureaucrats over a century and a half ago. And today, undoubtedly, it's one of North India's most popular and visited hill stations. But there's a lot more to this place than meets the eye. It's the gateway to the ancient hill kingdom of Chamba, the longest single ruled dynasty in all of India. In fact, the history, art and culture of this place is over 2,000 years old. It's also the scene of some of Himachal Pradesh's most exotic and rare cuisine. And that is what I am here for. What is this? Chana chaat or bun. Chana chaat or bun. One or two, please. Plate. There's no masala. So I finally found myself a local snack, some street food. We've got over here a chana chaat, which is chickpeas, boiled, soaked of course, and then just thrown together with some onions, tomatoes, green chilies, salt, lime and some chilli. It's good, man. It's big. It's good. Thank you. The combination of soft chickpeas and the onions, green chilies, all very, very fresh. And then this bun, nice and soft and local. Wow. Great stuff. Super. Even though I'd had my fill of local street food, I was yet to discover the true non-touristy flavours of Dalhousie. So I made my way to the stunning Chandri Ghat Palace for a royal rendezvous with an old friend of mine, Ravi Nandini Singh whose ancestors have ruled the kingdom of Chamba for generations. So this is your, what is this? This is the... This used to be the summer palace of the Raja of Chamba. Chamba. It is called Jandri Ghat because Jandri as in lock. Mm. So they would capture panthers here and shoot. Okay. You shoot know. them? Yes. yes. Okay, because there was a, it was a menace. It was At a menace. At that time there were so many of them. Yes, and you know, it was a That's sport the then. It, I'm talking a hundred years ago. Yeah, yeah, of course. At that time it was yes. game. And that's yeah. why the name Jandri Ghat. Brilliant. Come on, let's go check it out. Okay. Look at this tree house. Ah ha ha. My father built that for me when I was a child. So we are now in the Victorian veranda. That is correct. The actual veranda, the quintessential veranda. Yes, yes. What I want to ask you was, what about, do you cook yourself? I cook, but not Indian food. Not Indian food? No. So... I can introduce you to my cook who knows all the best local recipes. Best local recipes? Would you like that? Is there a question? <laughs> of course. He can cook me something? Absolutely. He's, yeah, he's, like one he of your cooks royal... really good mutton. NDTV's Cricket app. Android and iPhone. Faster scorecard. Special analysis. And much more. Download free. NDTV.com slash apps.